Christmas is right on the horizon, after a week to be exact. And I thought that since everyone's in the Christmas spirit, it's a perfect time to make a Christmas video and earn views. I mean, it's a perfect time to show some cool restroom builds. Since there's 7 days left, I will show you 7 cool restroom builds. Yeah, cool builds, not lit, cause it's Christmas. Disclaimer, I won't go much in depth how to build these machines block to block. If you want a more in depth tutorial of any of this, let me know in the comments and I'll do it. Let's start with number 1. We can't think of Christmas without a fireplace to sit in. I mean, a fireplace to sit next to, not on the fireplace. Usually in real life, we burn wood in the fireplace, while in Minecraft, we burn, well, basically a rock from hell. And I don't think that suits Christmas. And even lighting a campfire with a flint and steel isn't that amazing. So in this machine, all you gotta do is throw a piece of log in it, and it's gonna light a fire. How this works is that when you throw an item, it gets filtered, and if it's log, then sends an output to this dispenser which lights the fire. This dispenser may look ugly but we can't purge dispenser with pistons and hey, it's still better than that. Number 2. A daily gifter, a daily gift sender, a daily... I don't have a good name for this. But it does what you think it does, if you are thinking the right thing that is. Every day, one gift is gonna pop up in your barrel. You can easily integrate this thing in your house, either in the floor or roof. You gotta have a thick wall for this though. This is basically a machine which sends a signal every once a day. You can build this in your friend's house and put some random gifts in this dispenser. Now I know this might not really be gifts like Christmas gifts but how would I know what even a Christmas gift is? Yeah it's been tough. But it won't be tough if you're wise like number 3. The snowman of wisdom. I was thinking of something with snow and nothing was hitting me. No pun intended. To come up with an idea I needed some wisdom and that's why I built this. The way it works is that you throw a carrot to it and it will share its wisdom with you. Yeah, of course you gotta put the wisdom in there first. You can give this to your friend and with your wisdom or keep it to yourself. Put some random build ideas in and whenever you don't know what to do, just give this wise man a carrot and he'll give you some ideas. And the best part of all, if you press the button on its tail, it's a tail, trust me, every single carrot you threw will come right back off just to save you from a hazardous famine. Number 4. Let's be honest, we've all played snowball fights, if you have friends that is, oh, and mainly if there's snow to begin with. Let's not think about the snow problem, if you don't have any friends, you can make this snowball target. Once you enter, you'll be put inside some powder snow, which will limit your time of life. And as soon as you can, you gotta hit 10 snowballs within the first square of the target block. Now this game is fully up to you how you wanna design. You can change the accuracy if you want, you can maybe use some pistons to soak up the player so he doesn't spam right click and win, like I said, it's up to you. Number 5. I'm gonna be honest with you, this is not much Christmas related and neither is it that cool, mainly because I couldn't make it myself. You know fireworks right? I'm talking about in Minecraft. They are cool but how about explosive fireworks? And I mean literally. You see, if we make two TNT micro jumpers next to each other and then activate it so that they come in contact mid-air and blow up, it's gonna be really cool. Now I'm a slime block newbie so I couldn't make it and they just ended up breaking the ground consistently. But here's what it would have looked like. This is just the explosion not the minecarts included. Don't leave the video if you think this one is trash because the last two builds will blow your marbles. Starting with number 6. Now I have never been out around much during Christmas but I remember seeing fountains in Christmas movies. So I decided to make a fountain. Yeah. Now this isn't fully survival friendly yet. Because it uses skirk sensor for wireless redstone, but it looks cool. From the control panel room, you can turn on and off the lights and even turn off the water flowing. And if you want, you can add some fireworks too. I don't really know if this has anything to do with Christmas, but let's be honest, there's not much to build for Christmas, so this would be something really cool for a town center. And you can change the signal system however you want. And this is the last one, number 7. It's Christmas builds and we haven't included a Christmas tree. Now a Christmas tree which can be turned on and off with some lights is something that is cool but way too common. Now let's be honest, why would you turn off the lights? It looks so dark without. So hopefully no one would turn off the lights and making it the perfect switch for your hidden base. Yep, if I turn the lights off of this Christmas tree, a gate opens behind the tree and you can do whatever you want below the tree. Maybe some more restaurant. But I went for the look that is something below the tree, like underneath the tree, like you know the roots and stuff. Now I am no professional builder slash terraformer, but I think I did a good job. And with that, this video is concluded. 
like dislike share subscribe it's your will to do what you want but i would highly appreciate a comment and if you use any of these builds for video credit isn't necessary but i would really appreciate it also this is this video will go one day exactly one day after my channel completes three years on youtube so that's it really cool anyways thanks for watching stay safe along with me and i'll see you in my next video whenever it drops bye